Paws. Patriots and Paws. Oh, Patriots and Paws. Now so, I met... yeah, I'm going to ask you what you do here. Oh, no, well, I met them through... I met Penny through my daughter okay. that comes over here and... Right, but you come over and volunteer. Yes, Penny wants you to... I volunteer because my daughter volunteers. Because <laughs> you're and a... so vet. that makes two of us <laughs> volunteer, which we love anyway. And we love Penny, and we love to volunteer for her. Okay. And the more people that come, the more the happier that we are. And I wish, you know, the men would come more and see what she has here for them, which is wonderful. Mm -hmm. That's something we never had. Yes. When we came home, we came home, period. And that was it. Mm -hmm. You know, but now they have this, all of this here. Wonderful. That's great. Wonderful lady and giving. Yeah, she's very giving. Home. Yes, she's giving. Mm -hmm. She's got. She's got all this, and she's willing to give it away. Yes. So come and get it, right? Yeah. Well, I did. I came here about what, two years ago, I think, and I got my. Uh, I got a chair. I got a lot of dishes because I didn't have any dishes, right? And uh, I love cooking. Uh, I guess I went to culinary school. I guess that that counts for something, right? Um, so I came here. Oh, I can't remember all the stuff I got. Um, <laughs> I'm drawing a complete blank. But I got a lot of I got a lot of dishes. I got a lot of stuff that I needed that I just couldn't afford on the outside, you know. And, That's what I'm saying. And yeah. I know Penny is a good person, so she saved us a little bit, you know. Uh, yeah, it's, it's wonderful. Like, yes. Who could so, ask for anything more? Right. Yeah. So me coming back to Patriotic yeah. Plot and seeing yeah. how it is totally remodeled, changed, upgraded, it's, it's awesome. So we can help more female vets now. Oh God, I don't know where but all this stuff comes from, but it's wonderful that it's here for yes. them. And I wish they would come and get it. Right? Really. Because the more they take, the more they can bring in. Yep. Right? I like that. I like yeah. that. Yeah, okay. no, it's wonderful. Awesome. Yeah, Mom, and she said female veterans too. Mm -hmm. <laughs> the I never veterans. see the female veterans She's very one. much. There's I don't one. know where they're hiding. She's one. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but I mean, I don't, I really don't meet many. Well, I don't go to the club either because I spend most of my time with the men. Right. <laughs> with the male. <laughs> well, I'm glad you're not at the club. Right. <laughs> yeah, good. no, well, I, I find it. I had three brothers in the okay. service, so for me no to help the you. men, it's better. I feel better about it, and I know the women can take care of themselves. Mm -hmm. You know, mostly yeah, not the men. What yeah. were the branches of your brothers? I think um, you had a marine. Our one was a marine. That John was a marine. Right. And the the one was in the medics, and the other one regular army. Right. Yeah. I come from a military family as well. Yeah, so it was good. Yeah. yeah. In good. fact, my the youngest one, I didn't even know he was in the service until I got home. Oh, wow. <laughs> yeah. All of a sudden, somebody said, oh, John was in the Navy. I said, how did he get in the Navy? We got three Army and one Navy. That's all right. That's yeah. all right. Yeah. So Navy's we, a good branch. No, yeah, right. we spread it around. Yeah? yeah. <laughs> I like that. That was yeah, good. Yeah, it was wonderful. Well, it was really nice talking to yeah. you. Yeah, with you too. Yeah. yeah, great. I hope you had as good a time as I did. I sure did. Yeah. No, we had a lot of good times, you know. Mostly good times, I would say. Because when they came home and we heard the music, that for us was great. You yeah. know, we loved to see the men coming back home. Okay, and on. I thought, well, my brothers ought to be coming home, too. Mm -hmm. So it was good. It was a good time. What kind of music? Yeah, that was, what, 42 to 45? 42, 43, 44, yeah. 45. What kind of music? What time? What kind of music? Oh, dance music. You know, we had a, uh, we had a clubhouse. Mm -hmm. on, yeah. So at night, well, look, we could have the men that were on the island would come, but then if they come in from other places, you know, from overseas, that was there for them. They had the jukebox and they had the girls that would dance with them, whether they could dance or not, mm -hmm. you know. At least it was fun. It was good for them to have the girls there to greet them, you know, it was good. So we all, everybody, we all enjoyed having them. It was a happy time for us to have the men come home. That was 
him. And the women, we didn't really see too many other than the women that I had on the island. That's, that was our group. But there was also, on the shore, there was another a group of women on the shore, yeah. But we didn't see them too much because if we got any time off, it was at night. Not too much during the daytime to take off. So there were men, there were women. You know, we had a little bit of everything there. We had the permanent personnel, the men, and their wives and families. They lived there. It was just like a regular base. Yeah, it's a base. And it's still there today. Yeah. But it's not being used. Yeah, I don't think it's being used today. I took my daughter, I wanted my daughter to see the island. It was really neat, you know. Yeah, because you couldn't get off of there. You had to have a pass to go. <laughs> get the launch to go mm -hmm. and the launch to come back. And then the girls would, you know, they would spring these stories. You know, they'd call me up and say, my mother was on, you know, my mother was here on shore. Can I stay overnight? <laughs> no. <laughs> get back here. <laughs> I used to get them. It was fun, you know. They thought they were pulling something on me. You know, but they, I know what they were doing, but they had their little tricks, you know. But they were good. Yeah, we had, yeah. In fact, um, one, two, well, one lived in the Midwest. She passed away, Betty. I had two more in L.A., and both of them passed away, too, because they would communicate when I lived in L.A., mm -hmm. yeah, they would come and visit me, especially the ones in L.A., they would come and visit me. Yeah. And then both of them, lovely girls, passed away. So like I say, it was a good experience for any girl to even want to, you know, join the service. It's good. Are they buried at the Memorial Cemetery in West L.A.? Um, I don't know. No. Because, see, I didn't know that they had passed away until I wanted to go and visit them and so say, they had passed away. So I didn't get to see them anymore, but I did get to see them beforehand. I had visited them. But the one that lived in the Midwest, Betty, I didn't see her at all. But I heard that she had passed away. She was my little chum. So she was so cute. Yeah. So then they were gone, you know. It was a shame, but like I say, we had a wonderful group. Mm -hmm. They worked, and they loved it. Yeah, nobody said that they didn't like it. They all loved what they were doing for the men coming back from overseas. Okay. And like I say, and we also had permanent personnel, mm -hmm. men, on either side of the island, too. So we were surrounded. That's good. That's good. Okay.